Hello everyone, I am Ghulam Abbas. I hope you guys are fine and doing great. In this video, I am going to show you how you can install the VMware tools on uh, VMware. So basically, especially when you are facing the error of the missing component, you can have a look here whenever I am trying to inst uh, click on install VMware tools, it is giving me could not find component to update server. So basically, this, is a, this error is caused because of the missing file. The missing file is called Darwin.iso and you have to download it from the uh, official side of the VMware. So you need to download that one. So basically, open your Google and search there for VMware tools download and then the very first thing you have to see is download VMware tools. Open it. Uh, it is going to open inside the VMware tools official site and beside don't worry uh, if you are thinking that it is uh, premium no you have just to create a free account there as i have did you can have a look here and then just go ahead go to downloads and from there you will need to download the vmware tools for osx remember this too is only for the uh, Mac OS versions and the other version you can have a look here these are for windows uh, there is also a package for windows so basically i am telling you that you have to download one of these two these are only for windows i have already downloaded that one it is a zip file you can have a look here if i have to open it oops sorry i did i opened the wrong file so when you open it you will see these are the files darwin.iso I have already extracted on the desktop and now I have gotten to VMware settings and from there I have chosen CD slash DVD and then use ISO and then I just click browse you can have a look here once it's done connect it and now you can have a look here it is powered on with it so you can have a look here it is down there if I have to double click on it uh, I will basically be appearing to the installing vmware tools so basically this is the window where you will need to install the vmware tools it is easy uh, i know you can do it so just click next next and sorry continue and it is going to install it soon enough Okay, it's saying that the system extension is blocked. Just open up this security session from there and then uh, allow the VMware tools there because it is not an official app. So just choose on click. Okay, now after installing that one, it requires a restart of the macOS inside the VMware. It is going to take some time. I think the VMware tool is completely installed because you can have a look at the screen is basically uh, big compared to the previously that was a small portion of the window it contained. Now it is covering all the window so it seems like the installation of the vmware tools was successful and yes it is successful uh, it is kind of lucky because um, i have just installed it inside vmware i hope it should not be remain these like this forever so let's see just close this stuff okay now let's go ahead and close up the system preferences so you can have a look here that the vmware tools is basically installed and everything is set up uh, for us here 
so you can have a look here it is 4 gb of ram 120 gb mb of display make os 11.0 so this is how you can download and install the darwin in other words the vmware tools on the mac os pixel so i hope you like this video uh, till next time have a nice time and goodbye